morning everybody, welcome back to the channel, welcome back to the vlog, welcome back to the Renault. Yeah, looking like it's going to be another beautiful morning. We are in the yard just preparing to go. Uh, get the right gears. Uh, still only, still only the two of us working. All the other trucks are still parked up. I can see one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. I can see eleven Scanias. Bristol. We've got four vehicles to pick up in Bristol. We've got two people carriers or larger cars. <laughs> one Sephira and one Galaxy, so we've got to do it in a particular order. Uh, I've just got to jump out and lock this gate up. I think we're the only ones in the yard. Find my key. Oh. A bit chilly out there this morning. We need fuel down under our tank. We're going all the way to Bristol, so rather than stressing about where we're going to get diesel, we're going to get some locally. Once we get out of here, there you go, another. Sierra gear. I need that car. I didn't see if it was a two door or four door. It looks used. Oh, that sun's bright. Lovely. So, yeah, the country is still in lockdown. The roads are still nice and quiet for us. It looks like we're going to be at our first collection, which is going to be at a Sephira. At about half past eight. So I'll give them a call about eight o'clock. The thing is, we can, we can phone and collect cars from seven o'clock. But because we're on this lockdown, a lot of people are home and having lions and it was a very nice day yesterday so uh, there was lots of barbecues happening I could smell nothing but barbecues all afternoon driving for a full form of so there very could well be some thick heads this morning uh, so yeah it's a, it's a bit different when when uh, we weren't in this lockdown scenario because I was like phoning people at seven o'clock and telling them I'm going to be there in half an hour um, but I'm just I'm just too kind like that I'm too kind I don't like to phone people at seven o'clock and say I'm going to be there in half an hour when uh, most people probably aren't getting out of bed till nine ten o'clock <laughs> Yeah, I'm going to give a ring about half past eight and let them know I'm about half an hour away. So, go get some fuel. Moves you on up to Brizzle. I was knocked down, heard the countdown through the haze in the face of defeat, yeah. 
have reached Brizzle. Just going under the M5. Uh, is this the one I want? I think so. Ooh. Back in the lovely residential streets. like it went anywhere then but it does <laughs> I just see the gate Interesting. Okay. Ah. I think that's the house number we want. I can't see any car though. Right. Let's go see if I can find a car. Okay, that's ours a fair recollected. I can, uh, I can assure you that I did film it, 
and it, it is on the back I'm not making it up um, but GoPro being GoPro with this ultra reliability decided it didn't want to uh, save the file which is always really handy uh, I don't know where we need to go I'm gonna go this way our next drop or collection is a Renault Clio and now I'm going to go this way uh, it's a Renault Clio, it's about 40 minutes away and we're collecting it from a Halfords I didn't think any Halfords were open but I guess they are Oh, my joke, it's probably a workshop thinking about it. I don't know if the actual stores are open. Right. We shall uh, get on over to Halfords. And uh, I'll speak to you in a little while. Almost at our second collection. How Fords? It's just up the road. Uh, I don't know if you've seen from the uh, time lapse there, but we come through the centre of Bristol, and it is so dead. So dead. This truck's so noisy. <laughs> uh, 
Go on, by cyclist. Okay, so there should be a Halfords just up here somewhere. Speed ramps. and check out where this uh, little Cleo is. I don't know if you guys enjoy watching this as much as I enjoy watching it, but it's brilliant. Out and about, the sunshine, not sat on my backside all day, and uh, yeah, just doing something fun and proactive and being out, and I don't think I've ever got so much exercise. <laughs> right, all we've got to do now, strap this side down, put my chains away, put the ramp up, level the top deck off, go on to our next one. So that's good to go. Uh, oh, polo, got polo next. Well, apparently we're very close to picking up our next car. It's just round here somewhere. We we're only 10 minutes away from the, uh, from the last collection. So that was okay. for a polo. Silver I think it said it was.
there we have our three cars. We've got our Safira off the top, uh, our Clio, not very special, and we've got our little Polo. Um, so yeah, those two just your run of the mill uh, collections. This one, um, it's, it doesn't look like a scrapper because it's not. It's a, a catastrophic failure, I think they call it. Um, there's oil everywhere and no compression, so um, yeah, of course. Tiny little car though. So yeah, no, no potential projects today. I did pick up yesterday um, Citroën Saxo, which I posted on my uh, social media. Um, but yeah, that was, uh, they're getting rare they are. Um, but the guy had it sat on his driveway for 10 years. It was, uh, it was, it was a bit beyond, I think. Uh, definitely beyond my expertise. And uh, you know, it'd be nice to have a little retro classic like a Saxo VTR or VTS just to play around with, but I don't know, there's just no values in it or uh, no, no desirability for the, uh, for the amount of effort it would have took to, to get it back on the road. So a bit of a shame, but the search will continue. We'll find something. Okay, let's go. Suspension up, PTO's off. In gear, handbrake off. And we are good to go. Down to Yeovil. About an hour and a half away. I'm gonna go straight down A37 through Shepton Mallet and the likes. So yeah, about an hour and a half down to Yeovil, pick up our Ford Galaxy, our last car. And, uh, but we got, we got a sort of half hour break on the way down. So it's 12 o'clock now. So it's gonna be two o'clock down to Yeovil. Half hour to load, hopefully. Half two. Uh, back to the yard about half three, four o'clock. How very joyful. Yeah, six till four suits me down to the ground. That's pretty much what I've been doing all week. And uh, more than happy with doing that. McDonald's coffee so bad. The only place there is to get coffee is Costa Coffee out of vending machines. Um, I think most places have stopped doing coffee now or just won't serve lorry drivers. Serve NHS police and stuff but no to lorry drivers. So Costa vending machines when we can. Well that, that's why that's why I've got a flask now because flask and sandwiches nowhere to get anything. <laughs> On the plus side, I'm saving myself a fortune. So yeah, the hunt for a project continues. I don't know, I, I really don't know what I fancy like, like a French hot, like, yeah. Like a nice Renault or something. A Renault hot hatch. Or a Vol I'm a fan of old Vauxhalls. Old Fords. No, I don't mean like old, old expensive Fords. I mean just like the old uh, Mark IV Escort, something like that. Uh, I don't know, I just want quite fancy something a bit retro, modern classic type thing. Like I say, that, that Saxo would have been quite good because 
there's, uh, they're getting quite rare now, but yeah, just no desirability to it, and for, for the money that it would cost, it just wouldn't have been worth it. outside Liddles. direction to come back out again but I have to reverse with the car on the spec Galaxy loaded, uh, took all of 20 minutes, so not too bad, PTO in, hazards off,
Back to the yard, due back to the yard, 